What's up guys, Brian Grant here of ContestChampion.com and it's been a few days since you guys have seen a spreadsheet out of me so you know, I figured we'll, we'll, we'll do a little spreadsheet today. First of all, I want to show you what, uh, what the spreadsheet is going to be all about. So if we look at the four star champions here, let me actually just hide my face real quick. Um, I have quite a few of the four star champions. Um, I, have, I have 59 in total. If I get Loki tomorrow, it will be 60. And then I'm actually going to be uh, popping open some four star crystals. So if we hit up the crystals, put my face back on screen here. Uh, if we hit up the crystals, um, then you can actually see I do have quite a few of the four star hero crystal shards. Uh, almost enough for 12 champions. I don't think I'll quite make it there for tomorrow uh, unless there's you know, 400 shards. Actually, maybe I can finish up heroic. Maybe I'll do that. I don't know. I'll either have 11 or 12 crystals by tomorrow. That's the point, right? So, uh, I was kind of thinking about, you know, what, what champions do I want to see? What champions don't I have? And I realized I never did my, my four-star spreadsheet yet. Um, so, four-star spreadsheet, what I'm talking about is uh, if we go to my little spreadsheets over here. Uh, I, a while back, I made a three-star spreadsheet that uh, shows my, my current champions and all the signature stones that I, or the signature abilities for that specific champion, uh, how many I need in total for that specific class, and then how many I need in total, in total. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, in total right now, uh, there are 85 three-star three -star champions that I can get with some exclusions here that I mentioned back in that other video. Uh, and I'm, I'm gaining on this number, not quickly, but I'm, I'm gaining on the total number that I need. Uh, I, I need just under 5,000. I've, I've gained uh, 350 since I made that last video. Um, and I, I do have a bunch more signature stones that I could actually pump into those champions, but uh, basically just waiting on uh, the right the right time. So, um, you and real quick before I go to the, the four star version of the spreadsheet, I just want to point out that Immortal Iron Fist is the only three star champion that that I can obtain that I currently do not have. Uh, that's why he is uh, highlighted in red here. So you're gonna see this uh, this red a little bit more in the four star spreadsheet. Bum bum bum. <laughs> Actually, a lot more. Uh, there's red everywhere, guys. There's still a lot of four-star champions that I do not have, uh, and there's a ton of four-star champions that that are just not awakened, right? I, I tried to uh, come up with a way to, to show it on here for the ones that aren't awakened, but nothing really looked good. So um, I'm just gonna go with this. The red are the champions that I don't have. Uh, there's actually one less exclusion here, so if we flip back to the three-star one, uh, there's a Hulk here that uh, I, I removed in the four-star version because uh, and a four-star uh, four star version of Hulk is something that you can obtain. Um, now, it's a little bit debatable about uh, Kang and Thanos here. Technically, they are obtainable as four-star champions. Um, but realistically, eh, maybe not so much. I don't know. Maybe I'll add them on there at, at some point, right? Uh, Ultron here is the Labyrinth of Legends version of Ultron, which is only available as a five-star champion. Uh, and Deadpool requires money, so yeah, I don't, I don't have uh, Deadpool yet. So... Um, it requires money to get into the arena to have a chance at getting the four star one. So, yeah, technically, four star Deadpool by himself doesn't cost money, but uh, the requirements to uh, even participate in that do cost money. So, yeah, um, a lot of champions that I don't have, and a lot of champions, like I said, that are not awakened. They have the uh, the zeros here. Um, so, in, in mutants, it would be Colossus, the Red Cyclops, which uh, I you, you know I can uh, awaken him through uh, Labyrinth of Legends, but I haven't done it yet, uh, Gambit, Nightcrawler, and so on for a bunch of other of the champions out there, right? Um, so I was curious, though. I was curious to see how many signature abilities I do have with all of my four-star champions combined, uh, and you can see here that I only have 987, much lower than I thought, actually, uh, which means I still need 7,500 signature ability levels, and uh, when it comes to a three-star, I think I can gain on this number, and I am gaining on this number slightly, right? Um, when it comes to the four star, I don't know. <laughs> um, it's kind of kind of crazy. I think that number is just just getting higher and higher and higher, right? Uh, we'll have to see. We'll have to see. We'll have to check out on this uh, in in like you know a couple months or something like that. Maybe I'll start gaining on it once all of the three stars are maxed out, and I'm getting those max signature ability crystals much more frequently to gain more four star shards to uh, open up more four star champions, that kind of thing. I don't know. Um, I, I'm, it's definitely coming in faster and faster, though. The signature ability levels are definitely coming in faster and faster, especially since I started doing, um, especially since I started getting like the feature champion in Arena. Uh, that is why, you know, like Hood, boom, right off the bat, starts out at signature ability 20 since I got him twice, right? Uh, and actually, after seeing this, Iron Man is the current feature champion in Arena, and I already have him at signature 60. 
And I'm going for Loki because I, you know, I don't have Loki. So, of course, getting a champion is, is like the top priority. If I don't have that champion, I want that champion. Um, but Iron Man's already at 60. So, originally, I, I, I wasn't... I wasn't going to go for Iron Man as the as the feature champion at all. I was going to take a rest from the arena. Now I'm, I'm kind of tempted, though, because the closer he gets to 99, uh, of course, then I'll get the max signature crystals for, um, you know, for the, for the opening up four-star champions and get more five-star shards and stuff like that. So I don't know. It's actually kind of tempting. It's, it's kind of tempting. I'm not sure what I'm going to do about that yet, but uh, it's, it's still, still pretty interesting nonetheless. Uh, so there's 86 total champions of four stars that I could possibly obtain. Uh, if we uh, include a couple of those, these other ones here, Kang, Thanos, and Deadpool, then technically someone out there might have 89 champions right now, 89 four-star champions, which is crazy. Uh, but there's, yeah, so there's 86 in total that I can obtain. I have two of them maxed out at 99, uh, and I don't have it on here, but like I said previously, I have 59 four-stars in total. So um, uh, to me, this is interesting. I know to some of you, you're like, who cares? Uh, open up some crystals already, <laughs> and, and don't worry, I'm opening them. I'm opening them up tomorrow, uh, and I'm actually going to update this spreadsheet after tomorrow's opening, so we can see right away how how things change uh, in tomorrow's opening. So, uh, I, well, one one stipulation though, I have to get Loki in the arena tomorrow uh, before I do the opening. If I miss out on Loki somehow, then I'm going to try again in the following round to get Loki, and then I'll do the opening. But I I should have it locked in tomorrow, right? Um, I'm, I'm pretty confident in that, so uh, look forward to that guys, the 4 star opening coming tomorrow, uh, if we go back to the game here real quick, again it'll either be 11 or 12 uh, 4 star crystals, I'm not sure, it all depends on how uh, how, how tonight goes, it's probably going to be 11 though, don't get your hopes up for, for that 12th one, <laughs> um, I'm not getting my hopes up for it at least. Uh, and, and yeah, that's going to do it for this video, guys. Hopefully uh, you enjoy seeing some of the, uh, the madness of trying to really beat this game uh, as well as I can, right? <laughs> um, if, that's, if that's even such a thing, beating Marvel Concept Champions, right? Um, but just progressing as, as, well as, as well as I can. Uh, and I will see you guys in the next video or late night live stream. Take care.